to oh, oh forget that phone somebody, call. That's somebody else's line. Okay, yeah. great. <laughs> <laughs> well, hello, Haley. You're right in the event. This is the graduation event, so for the commencement ceremonies. Yep. So people have joined this event. But if you join the event, but you have an RSVP online, go there right now. Yes, we have only had 375 people RSVP. I know we have more people walking in than that because more people ordered regalia than that. So, um, yes, please get on there and RSVP. Just we want to make sure that we have everything ready. We have enough chairs on the floor. We have enough diploma covers on the stage for you. So please RSVP and let us know that you are wanting to walk and that we get your name correct too. And it's like planning a party. You know, yes. you, you don't want people to show up and not have a chair or a plate. For right. Them. I think yeah, there was one year where we didn't have enough chairs on the floor, so they were like hurry up and like I think it was the faculty though that in their spot we had to hurry up and get chairs out as they were walking. So we don't want to have to do that again. Nope, just fill out the form real quick. Mm -hmm. I looked at the form. It's super easy. It, it to takes do. like thirty seconds. And um, if you want to record your name, so we make sure to get your name correct, you have the chance to do that there too. And that link is in an email as well to record Yes, uh, it's been names? in a couple of the emails and then we'll have another email going out shortly um, that'll also have the link in it. But why wait for the link when you can just go to the commencement website and do it from there? So. Ah, very true, very <laughs> true. Um, so we had a question last week, which was I've double majored, maybe I've triple majored. And I'm getting degrees from the Institute of Arctic Biology. I'm getting degrees from the College of Fisheries and Ocean Sciences. And I'm getting degrees from the College of Liberal Arts. I'm really, really worked really hard. Do I get to walk all three times? Okay, so <laughs> unfortunately the answer is no. You don't get to walk three times. It is just one time that you or walk two across times. the stage. Um, or two times. So we have double majors and double degrees. Double degrees can sometimes be in two different colleges. Uh, which if that's the case, then you can choose what college you want to work with. Both of your degrees will still be red, but yeah, you only get to walk actually physically across the stage once. Um, we'll have a card for you in both spots. So even if it's like the day of and you haven't decided who you want to walk with yet, um, we'll have it ready for, for you in both spots and you can walk to one college or walk to the other college. Um, but you only do get to actually physically cross the stage once. And that's for expediencies sake. Yeah. And which is important. And that's also a question. Yeah, because yeah, we, we don't want it to deal with those four hour. Uh, no, it's a huge day. Again, it's a big so. day. But, you know, it's, there's also the logistics of things. Yeah, and we, but we still want to honor you and, you know, read both of your degrees. So, yeah, both of them will be read. But, yeah, you do only walk once and you get one diploma cover. And, oh, one diploma cover. Yeah. One but you can buy an extra one. You can buy an extra one. Yeah, they do sell them at the bookstore. Or you could you could have won one. Or you could have won one. At um, the grad fair. Yeah, we also gave away that ago. diploma frame. That was weeks ago. It doesn't, <laughs> it feels like it was years ago. Yeah, it does. I don't it know does. why this semester has just been really weird on timing. It's Sometimes it feels like it's really quick and then other times slow. Well, I think it's because you're doing two things, Haley. You've got your work and things, your own personal, and you're raising a family. <laughs> and family, school, yeah, it's a, it's a busy, busy time of year. But that's a good thing. You're not alone in that many right. students are in the exact same thing how to balance yeah. all of those things so yeah. that's why commencement you want to make sure that it's a mm -hmm. great day but also you can do all the other stuff yes we want to do. honor you because you have made an amazing accomplishment and you survived it all <laughs> um any other deadlines that are coming up or it's pretty much just it's all happening now is there any everything's yeah pretty much in the swing of things um we're going to start doing our you know practice commencement polls you know to make sure the book is all printed correctly so we'll be proofing that so um, yeah, kind of your part is done. If you've RSVP'd and you've ordered your regalia, now you just need to wait for the, the day of. If your degree works looks all good, then, I mean, we're in the home stretch now, so you can not relax because you still have like No, there's finals and there's, still still there's no way. That to do. But as far as commencement goes, you can kind of, The yeah, ceremony is going to happen. Yes. Um, and it's May 4th. May 4th. And doors open at noon for visitors. Mm -hmm. Yep, doors open at noon. So that's when you can start lining up to join your college um, at the Carlson Center. Um, that's how you line up is by your college. So we'll have signs up uh, saying what college is where. And we'll go over that too in more emails that you will be getting. Um, but yeah, so doors open at noon. Um, processional starts at 1.20. So don't wait until like 1.15 to get there. Please get there. Like 12.30 is like a good time. You know, you don't have to be there right at noon. But um, yeah, like 12.30 is good. Do you know who the, the student speaker is? I do not. I don't know if that has been announced yet. I, I am not on that committee. so. <laughs> I, but I heard that, it, yeah, the name is coming soon. So, so the student speaker... Uh, recognize some dignitaries and all that sort of stuff yep, that goes yep. on. And then the class of 2019. Yep, very exciting. So which is the, where, how do you start your, your tassel? Is it start oh on the left-hand side? Oh my gosh, that question side, comes up all the time start and I can never right -hand remember. Side. I think me and JR, like JR had to Google it when we were at the grad fair because someone wanted to take a picture of the grad cap and we couldn't remember what side it starts on and then you move it and... 
Yeah. So there'll be people there to help you sort yeah, that out. Yeah, or Google is always picked there. I don't, I don't remember either. There. I, I really need to look that one up and get it burned into my brain. Next year it'll be all we'll talk about yeah. on the show. Um, okay, thank you, Haley. Thanks for taking some time. Oh, yeah, oh, go I did think of one more oh, thing. Oh, good, good, if good. If you are here in Fairbanks, but you are a UAS or UAA student and you want to walk at, at Fairbanks because you are really awesome too and it's hard to travel sometimes. Um, please just oh. send us an email and let us know that you want to walk in our commencement, um, that you are a UAS student or a UAA student, and uh, so that way we will make sure to have a card for you. So any school in the University of Alaska system? Yeah, we all help each other out, and you know, we know it, this is a big state, that it's hard to you know, go down to Anchorage you know, to walk in their commencement, or it's hard to get to Juneau to walk in their commencement. So, um, or if your family is in Fairbanks, but yeah. you're graduating from UAS. Right, you so you're more back. than welcome to walk at commencement here in Fairbanks. You walk across the stage the same. Uh, you get your diploma cover. Um, it, I think we, I can't remember how it's read exactly, but we, yeah, we'll figure that out. Um, but yeah, that's if, a if great, you want to walk here, thing. yeah, just send us an email so that way we make sure to have you down and include you in things. See, we've done this for two years now. This is the first time that I've heard <laughs> that detail that. on the show. So. And like, well, like, especially like we have all our nursing students. UAA has the nursing program here in Fairbanks. So yeah, we do have a lot of Fairbanks-based students who are UAA students and you're more than welcome to walk with us. Thank you. And so if you've got honors degrees, anything like that, talk to your honors professors, talk to you about how to get those cords and all sorts yes, of things Yes, yeah. Like that. We only talk hand out the institutional honors, so the cum laude, summa, those ones. Um, but like Golden Key and, you know, the nec uh, next gen, that's a form, um, the first gen students, uh, yeah, you're going to want to talk to the faculty or staff person that's in charge of those. And they'll be able to things. hook you up with those yeah. things. Thank you very much, Haley. Great, thanks. And see you next, well, I'm, I'm gone next week, so oh, not we'll Tuesday, but I'll try to go later in the week because we okay. can't miss an episode. Now. I'll be here. Okay. <laughs> Bye. Bye.